Hi ladies, welcome back to my channel and to my closet. Today's video, I'm doing a thrifted haul showing you my favorite designer and vintage coats, jackets, and blazers. If you're new here for the first time, I just want to say hello. My name is Pip and I make sustainable fashion videos focusing on rewearing my old pieces from my closet and showing you that you can thrift shop and still not spend a lot of money and still look expensive. Now let's get onto the thrift haul. So my first item today that I'm showing you is actually a matching blazer to my skirt I have on. And I don't know if you can see my skirt because I have my camera set at one angle today, but this is a lovely blazer and I got it from a consignment shop in my local town and it is by Gino Rossi for Wilson. I don't know if you can see the, the writing there and it was made specifically by this designer for Wilson. So this is a very kind of rare um, set and it was $10. It used to be like $18 but they marked it down. So, let me try this on for you. I love that it only has one button because I feel like one button is just very flattering on a woman's figure. And if you want to make it more modern because it is a suit from the 80s, so when you are vintage shopping, um, think of things like your accessories that you have. For example, I have a leopard belt here. Okay, so what I like to do is I really like to just cinch or overlap the front of this and a lot of women do this it's really cute and you can cinch the waist with a belt to update and modern a vintage blazer so it doesn't look so outdated the best thing about this blazer is I can literally wash it and put it in the washing machine so this is my first item and I love that it's a set I will not always wear it as a set obviously I do feel that doing it separately is a little bit more modern. So today I'm just kind of wearing my skirt and a basic top, whatever, just pairing it with basic heels and focusing on the jewelry. So the second piece that I'm showing you is one of my favorite finds ever. I got it at the Goodwill. It's Calvin Klein and it is a beautiful faux fur. I call it like a cape bolero because it's a little bit longer and it does look like a cape. And I'm just gonna throw this on for you. And this, at only $10, I knew that this was a lot more expensive. So it's probably close to 200. But I fell in love with this and it's a size medium, which is a little bit bigger than I like to wear. But I think that it's really cute oversized because for me, I just like to leave it open and I would wear this with jeans. Obviously, I'm not gonna wear it with my red skirt I have on, but I would wear this with a straight leg pair of jeans, the same top I have on underneath, and a pair of like Converse sneakers, just to make it more casual. I'd probably just wear like um, my Coach handbag then. I just, I know Coach is not very popular anymore, but I gravitate to this bag all the time, and this bag is over 10 years old and it has seriously held up better than my Louis Vuitton. So I'll be honest with you, I'm a big fan of Coach just because I feel like they're made very well. But yeah, I would definitely wear this and the coat or the Coach bag, some straight leg jeans, some Converse, and maybe if I was feeling a little bit extra chic, maybe even do like a beret, a black beret or something. So I love this. I feel like it is so, so luxurious and it's warm and I can't wait to wear it to like go out to dinner or something. I just, I love it so much. So my next item is a blazer I thrifted and I think I spent about $3 on this. And this came from my local thrift store. It's not a chain and I love the amount of clothing they have in this place. It is just overloaded with clothing. It has a lot of like old lady clothing. So there's a lot of old 
vintage blazers. So I fell in love with this Berry Eye Bricken blazer because it has like beautiful shades of colors mixed in. It has like really cool mauves, really pretty like grays, uh, like cool blue tones. There's like purples in there. It's just beautifully lined, if you can see that. I knew by the label that this was a very high-end blazer and I fell in love with it because of the details. It is cut so well and it has a beautiful little button in the front here. Just one little cool black button and it has these great sleeve details. So I seriously just love the colors of this and I feel like it fits so well. When I go thrift shopping, vintage is so important to me to find because I'm petite and if I find the right size, I feel like everything fits me so much better in the arms and the sleeves. I feel like the, I'm just never like swimming in the clothing. For like jackets, I just love vintage. So I love this. I plan on just wearing it with like a Levi's jean, mom jeans, heels, or flats. I mean, whatever. It's just a very cute blazer. And opened, it looks really good too but I'm loving it and I just love that there's a lot of possibilities that I can style this with. Next item is another blazer and I got it from the same thrift store uh, as my last one. And this one is by RRRR Russ, Division of Russ Togs Inc. And I just, I don't really know too much about this brand. I didn't really look it up. This is just the best blazer ever because I was looking for a blazer that doesn't have shaping to it. I wanted a straight cut blazer. So I love that it can be worn open and I can wear it dressed down with jeans and sneakers or I can dress it up by overlapping it and belting it. Okay, so here is another awesome blazer. I got this from a consignment shop and I think I paid about $7 for this. This is a vintage Liz Claiborne, New York, and I love it. I love it, love it. And it's almost like patchworky, which is really trending for spring 2019. So I think I'm gonna get a lot of use out of it this spring. I just love that it's just got so many colors in it, which is just so fun. And this again is oversized and I don't mind it. So I can just roll the sleeves up like that and I love it. Now it's a little, it's so oversized that it does overlap a lot in the front, but I'm okay with that. I think wearing looser clothes is very fashionable, very on trend right now. So I really like this and I'm not going to roll the other sleeve up, but I wanted to just show you the options. If you have an oversized blazer, that is just a great way to make the sleeves fit without having to alter them. So this would be really nice layered over top and the inside is really cool too. It's just fun and it's bold and bright and it's so not like me to wear something this bright. The next item is a coat that I got. I got a beautiful trench coat. I have been looking for a very classic trench because I never had one. I have a trench coat that is like a jacket and it's really short and it's just really not that comfortable to wear so I don't wear it that often but I actually found this at my consignment shop and I think I paid ten dollars for this and it's Michael Kors and I love it it's a dark brown and I just love how it fits it's definitely newer and I tied the back just because it's very slippery fabric, it's very vinyl-y, and um, it's really, um, when I don't have this tied, it just, the waist belt goes all over the place. So I'm leaving it open just to show you, and I love how it fits. Perfect, perfect, perfect. A dark brown is just very classic. It, for me, it's nice to have the dark brown and not that classic tan that you always see. So. When I have, when I'm in the mood to wear brown and brown boots, 
then this is my go-to coat. It's lined beautifully, it was in perfect condition, so for $10, I feel like it did score. And these prices I paid for the consignment shop is higher, much higher than I do with my thrift store, so I don't go there as often. But when I do go there, I'm looking for designer, designer, designer. Okay, my next item is a vinyl coat. And I've seen these trending on the runways, and I just really never had this crazy of a coat in this color especially. I mean, you have to have guts to wear this type of coat. But I got this from my local resale boutique in town, which I love so much. It's called Becky's Closet, and uh, it's one of the cutest boutiques I've ever seen. And it's resale, so she goes to people's houses, they bring clothing to her. She's always finding people and getting clothing everywhere she goes to stock her store, which is really cool. Whenever vinyl's in on trend in another couple of years, um, I will have it. And I just like where it sits on the low hip. And um, I have some altering to do to it. So I do have to alter the sleeves a little bit. So I'm gonna learn how to sew with the vinyl and figure out how I can alter it to fit me a little bit better. So this coat is from my local thrift store that I got my other blazers from I showed you. And I think I got this the same day that I got the blazers, one of the blazers. This is really something that I've been looking for for a long time. It is just the perfect camel coat. And Karen Britt Chick, who is another YouTuber on here, who I love her videos and I just love her sense of style. She had been on a camel coat hunt forever and I ended up finding one when she was still talking about searching and searching. I found one and I couldn't believe it. And I mean, I think if she had found this, she would have taken it as well. And uh, I'll leave her link to her channel down below because I just like want to give her a shout out because I know how special finding the, the perfect camel coat is. So I got this at the thrift store that I told you about. It's Neiman Marcus label. When I saw the Neiman Marcus label, I didn't even care if this thing fit. I was like, oh my gosh, this is not even funny. It's 100% pure cashmere. It's amazing. This like, it is, it fits, it fits really well. It's super duper long, <laughs> which I don't mind, um, but I definitely, it is ankle length. It is ankle length and the lining on the bottom, I need to kind of raise it a little bit. Um, but look at this beautiful coat. It is unbelievable. It's slightly big, but, and I don't mind. It did have a belt, but it didn't come with it because one of the belt loops is missing. So I don't even care. I'm gonna remove the other belt loop and just use a regular belt over top of it or even a scarf. So I don't mind, I will leave it open, but look at how beautiful this thing is. And the sleeves, they come down right where they should sit, um, right to the middle of my band. I am like just, I could not believe it. I think I paid $7 for this, I believe. I think I got it on a, on sale, extra sale. And I do love it with my heels. Definitely I need to wear heels, but I can also wear like a sneaker with it. Uh, so I'll probably wear my Converse All-Stars with it, my black ones. It's just so warm and it's just the perfect like luxurious coat and it can be dressed up or dressed down. And I think that if you can find the perfect camel coat uh, that you are really, you know, it's not easy to do. So when this came my way, I was like, there's no way I'm not taking it home. I feel like it's very Angelina Jolie. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed my thrift haul and my try on today. And let me know in the comments below what you think and what was your favorite piece today. And Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and notification bell if you want to see future sustainable fashion videos. I'll see you soon, guys. Bye.